in the previous video we did the simulation of ac circuit containing resistance only now in this video we will do simulation of ac circuit containing inductance and capacitance but before starting the simulation let us revise some theoretical part again the supplied voltage is given as v is equal to vm sin omega t and the current flowing through the circuit is expressed by this expression because now there is inductance in the circuit so the expression of current will be this and after solving this we will get equation number two and in equation one and equation two we should be able to see that the phase difference between voltage and current is pi by two that means voltage is leading current by pi by two which is true in case of inductive circuit then to obtain instantaneous power of the circuit we have to multiply equation 1 and equation 2 and equation 3 is the final expression for the instantaneous power now let us continue to this simulation I have taken the same circuit and now we will The supply voltage is 100 sin omega t and the uh, inductance value will be 5 milli henry current and voltage are measured through these two parameters and the waveforms are will be seen in this scope now let us run the simulation Here we can see that the voltage is leading current by a certain angle and since this is a purely inductive circuit that angle must be pi by 2 so the current is lagging a pad voltage by angle pi by 2. I am changing this value because it will be easier for us to interpret the output waveform at this value. Now let us run it. This is the output waveform we have obtained. Blue is the output waveform of power and purple is of the voltage and yellow is of the current here we can see that the positive value of voltage and negative value of current results in negative cycle of power and positive voltage positive current results in positive power and positive current and negative voltage results in negative cycle of power also we can see that the frequency of output power is twice the frequency of input voltage as the power waveform is symmetrical its average value is zero so no consumption of power physically we can say that at positive half cycle inductor draws power from the supply to build magnetic field and at negative half cycle it releases the stored energy to the power supply now it's done for the capacitor the theory the theoretical part is similar but in case of capacitor the current leads the applied voltage by certain angle that is pi by 2 and the instantaneous power is given by the equation 3 
here we can see that the voltage lacks current by pi by 2 or current leads a pi voltage by pi by 2.